Hello everyone! Today, I'm going to show you how to fold my new model, Origami Tricorn Pixels, that you can use to create beautiful origami wall art. The Tricorn Pixels are compatible with the Pyramid Pixels I showed you in the last video. Here's an example of what you can do with six tricorns. An hexagon that looks a bit like a slice of lime or lemon. The tricorns are joined by folding on the back, and they look quite good on the back as well. You can use them to make stars or snowflakes. In the next video, I will also show you how to make inside-out tricorns. They are also compatible with the pyramids and the regular tricorns, and you can create cool things with them, like this hexagon that transforms into a star. So please don't forget to subscribe. To make a tricorn pixel, you need a square piece of paper, and if your paper has a white side, put it on top, then fold the square vertically, Mark the fold and unfold. Fold the square horizontally. Mark the fold and unfold. Then fold all four corners to the center. Then unfold all corners and bring this corner to the bottom corner. But don't fold, we are just going to make a small pinch here and another small pinch here so that we can find the middle of this line right here and here and we'll do the same thing for this point and this point so bring this corner to this corner and just make two small pinches so that you can see those points then Bring this corner to this point. And we are going to mark the fold all the way from here until we get to this crease here. And we'll do the same thing on the bottom. So this corner to this point. And we mark the fold until we get to this intersection. Then we are going to make a fold from here to here. So to do this, take this corner and bring it to this point. And we'll mark the fold only in the middle, between the two creases. And same thing to make this fold here, bring this corner to this point. and mark the fold in the middle. Unfold and turn the paper to the other side. And we'll make a fold from the center to this corner. So bring the top corner to the bottom corner. And mark the fold from the corner until you get to the center. Then unfold, turn the paper to the other side, and we are going to mark this fold again. So just gently push here, and pinch the paper together here, and we are going to bring this point to this corner. like this. And 
Now just fold this tip to this point. And unfold it. And now we are going to fold along this crease. Like this, mark the fold well. And the next step is to bring this part to this side. So just rotate this part like this. And then we, you want to push this over there. And you have to force it a little bit. And if you will, so this is so that you can get a strong lock for your tricorn. So it's going to be a bit messy like this. So just take it on the other side so that you can form back the angles like this to have clean uh, angles. And your tricorn pixel is ready. If you want to lay it uh, flat on the table, you can just push those flaps inside. So those are the flaps that we will use to join the tricorn to other tricorns. But in order to lay it flat, just fold them inside a little bit. And your tricorn pixel is complete. Once you have made your first tricorn, just fold another and I will show you how you can uh, join them together. So to join them, turn them to the other side and we'll use those flaps to join them. So just take two flaps and Put the flaps over each other like this and you have to hold them under like this and you have to fold in the air so it's a little bit difficult but after a couple it will be easy. So just fold this like this and mark the fold. Keep your finger pressed so that it doesn't go away and fold on the other side. Like this. Mark the fold well. And just rotate those flaps inside. And again, Mark the folds well. Fold the way. And your three corners are now joined. You can push back the unused flaps inside. And your three corners are joined. I hope you like this new Tricorn module. I love reading your comments, so please let me know what you think and tell me if you prefer the front or the back. In the next videos, I will show you how to make the inside out Tricorn module and also a slightly different Tricorn that looks even more like an orange slice. And there is a double Tricorn coming up too. So please subscribe to get notified and to encourage me to create more easy and fun origami models. I would love to see what you create with the pyramids and the tricorns, so please send me pictures. I will add them to the origamipixels.com website and show them in future videos. Have you tried the square origami pixels? You can make very beautiful mosaics with them and they are also very easy to fold and to join. We are making a collaborative origami mosaic by joining mosaics made all over the world. If you would like to participate, I will put a link to it in the description of the video. Thank you very much and happy folding!